why I have these scissors in my hand has nothing to do with Prince, okay? Uh, I'm only saying that because uh, it deserves it. And also, uh, Prince, as you know, was, uh, or maybe you don't know, one of the biggest su supporters of women's rights. Uh, as you know, the last time he played the show box, he uh, had an all-women band, uh, even going back into the 80s. You know, he had Wendy and Lisa with him. Anyhow, uh, uh, the last couple of days you've probably seen that we've had this caution tape out here, and uh, we were putting in a, a star for a West Seattle woman named Frances Farmer. Now, I don't know if any of you know who Frances Farmer is, but in 1939, she was the most popular actress in Hollywood, along with Grace Kelly and Catherine Hepburn. But she was from West Seattle, lived right down the road here. She was a graduate from West Seattle High School. She was valedictorian of West Seattle High School. She was cum laude at the University of Washington. And she was one of the most gorgeous women that has ever walked the streets of West Seattle. Now, <clears throat> she went on to have a very short and brief Hollywood career. And unfortunately, uh, kind of got blacklisted by Hollywood because she was too smart for her own good, maybe, at a time where women didn't speak out. And she started, she stopped getting jobs because of that. And eventually, as crazy as this may sound, she was put in the same asylum. In 1982, Jessica Lange won an Oscar playing her in, in the film Francis. And you know, there's never really been a lot done for Frances Farmer uh, here in West Seattle. Not a lot of people know who she is. There's no memorial anywhere. Some people think they know where her old house is, some people don't. There's nothing at West Seattle High School, there's nothing at the University of Washington. And personally, and on Easy Street's behalf, and all the girls that work in here, it's ridiculous that nothing has ever been done. Does anyone agree with me on that? Oh, yeah. So, uh, um, my friend uh, uh, Jack Halbert at uh, Green River Tile on Floor helped me put this uh, star in that we're going to unveil here in just a minute uh, over the last couple of days. So I'd like to thank him for donating his time. I'd like to thank uh, Petter and Clay Eels at uh, the Southwest Historical Society for endorsing the project on uh, allowing us to put a star here. Originally it was going to be on the sidewalk and then there were some political changes. Not political changes here in West Seattle, but political changes in the city that would not allow us to put it on the sidewalk. Again, sounds crazy. but. Anyhow, it's on private property, it's on Easy Street's private property, and I'm going to cut the scissors right now, and I'm just very grateful that you're all here, and uh, let's just uh, memorialize uh, an, an iconic woman for as long as Easy Street's here, as long as this building is here, and uh, also in the name of Prince for women's rights, here's to Francis Farmer.